everybody, I promise I'm not naked. I'm just very hot. <laughs> All right, where's Liam with these jazz? And then we're going to visit a planet. Lexi, Le there's Liam. All right, let's go find Liam. Strike team ready for deployment. Hi, Liam. I know, and I'm just gonna. I got a copy of the Nexus's stuff. movie library. Thanks. I'll look through it. It's probably all agricultural learning vids, but there might be something good. I'll keep you posted. Hmm. I wonder why I'm quiet. Sorry about that. Again, I don't know how to fix it because this is through PS4, so all of this stuff is pretty automated. Yeah, I don't, I don't know, man. Gil, what are you doing outside of your habitat? The Angara was super curious about the ship. Okay. A few were pretty bold. Thanks for the tip. Asked me questions. What do you make of them? They know their shit. Quick-minded, sharp. They'll make good allies. How's your friend Jill doing? Good. Busy. Apparently, prepping multiple species for procreation is a lot of work. Let's make yeah. it a baby. Waiting to get it all started was killing her. Now she's being shot out of a cannon, so to speak. Be something I could put on my shoulders just to make people not think I'm naked, though. If I just just tape this shit up like that. <laughs> Good talking to you, Gil. Maybe eventually I'll cool down and I'll be able to put a put a robe on. Put a robe on it. Right now, man. You know what's fun about Pilates? Need though? something? Um, I. So I have a few friends that I'm close enough to that I let them smack my ass. You know, and I'll smack their ass too. It's just like a friendly thing. But at least three of my friends since I've started working out have slapped my ass and then give me the oh shit face. Like, oh bitch, you've been working out. I ran across so anyway, another memory just, fragment. Like, in the shower. Dad made Sam for mom to cure like, her. I knew that was part of it, but... You didn't know it was the driving force. If you like it, then you should have put a robe on it. If you like it, then you should have put a robe on it. Here, he gave up everything me. trying to save her. You didn't realize how important his family was to him? No. I guess not. Because he's an asshole. Maybe that's what he wanted you to see. All right, bye. I'll let you get back to it. <laughs> I'll be here if you need me. I really look naked, though. Like, if somebody from Twitch comes in here, I'm getting banned. If you like it, then you should have put a robe on it. Don't be mad if you see me here naked. If you like it, then you should have put a robe on it. Uh, 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 uh. How long does it take to learn piloting? What do you Depends do? how you apply yourself. With your mind, you'd be adept in a few weeks. Oh, that's such a nice thing to say. I miss more. Oh, the ship manual's useful. That leg of my workbench needed propping up. If you bothered reading it, you'd know that the Tempest is an orchestra of new tech. You can't just meddle with. I got this ship launch ready in record time, Callo. I know my stuff. And you don't have a shred of respect for other people's. Ooh. Callo. Oh, Ryder. Sorry you had to hear that. Why was she mean to Callo just then? Gil was being an asshole. Hang on, let's see if I can. What can I do for you? Oh, yeah, I can. I couldn't help overhearing you and Gil. Sounded pretty heated. He likes redesigning things, I don't but want the ship to was built you. this way for a reason. I wish Gil would respect that. It's nothing to concern yourself about, really. Okay. I'll let you concentrate. I'm busy you enough where I'll be. errands for everybody in the fucking galaxy, so I will let you two fight and not make it my business. <laughs> Alright, Suvi, you want to talk about shit? Pathfinder. No? Okay, good. I should get back to things. Sounds good. I should get back to things. Ugh. Always so eloquent. I wonder if she is, uh, I just don't feel like messing with my loadout. I think this is where it hurts me to play a sci-fi game as opposed to playing a, a, a fantasy game, which is my preference. In a fantasy game, I will sit there and I will make a thousand swords and daggers and staffs, as those of you who watched that 400-hour Let's Play of Dragon Age know 
But when it comes to making guns or modding guns, or like I just don't care. I don't want to do it. You've been at this it longer than any of us have. So between you and me, what do you think of our chances? Our chances for what? Surviving. It'll be okay. Yeah. All right. Thanks, old man. Oh, Drag is such a granddaddy to us all. I love him. Neither y'all got nothing interesting. To I do. always have time for you. Oh, you what? probably Wait, have work to shit. do. We can chat later. If I can flirt. You know where to find me. I always have time for you. That you're trying to get it in. Hello, Marshmallow. Hey, kid. Did Lexi brief you on Sam and squad connectivity yet? Yeah. You want to hook that thing up to my comm, sure, but that's where it stops. Putting an AI in your head, giving it access to everything like that, it's begging for trouble. Sam is part of what makes someone a Pathfinder. Well, You're just going to have to deal with that. So long as it's not in my head and it ain't messing with my body. That's we can fair. talk more later. Sure. Hate the limitations of these conversations. Like, I don't want to say either of those things to him. They're not sensical. You don't have to be a hard, hard line about something so insignificant. He said exactly what he felt. Why does that need to be any kind of, well, you better be okay with it for me? But he wasn't saying he had a problem with it for you. He literally said, if it affects me, Your that's what I have a problem. Have such fire, PB. It's thrilling. You were bold to make the journey here. Damn it, John. Yeah? <laughs> Thanks. I guess I was. M. Seriously. And Cora. I imagine your decision was mindful of your potential and brilliance. Um. First of all, Jal, you were for me. Stop flirting with my other people. Second of all, it's good to know that a sorry charm works uh, even outside of their own galaxy. <laughs> Hi there. Hello. All right, well. See you later, Cora. You had nothing interesting. I'll be here. Well, we're just going to talk the rest of them, then we're going to another planet. Why is the lift never down? Almost got to press a goddamn button. I don't like Cora. But I'm happy you like her. Hello. That's enough. Until we've established a better Please trust don't with each other. Eyes are man, back to fuck off my bitch. Rude as shit. PB, tell this man you are taken. I don't actually like any of them. Hey, yeah. What's shaken? Bacon. What was it like for you on the Nexus? Well, I wasn't supposed to be woken up yet. That ex friend I mentioned, my accomplice, so she finagled my early thought. So I kind of lived off the grid. Snuck around, bullshitted my way onto excursions off station. After I found my first remnant ruin, I started, uh, borrowing shuttles. After that, I didn't spend much time on the Nexus. I even missed most of the revolt. Are we gonna flirt again? I guess, but everything badass about Korra is in the past. She's not a badass anymore. Like, she refuses to stand up to me and be like, you shouldn't be fucking Pathfinder. Like, at least that would be something interesting. But instead she's just like, eh, I'm used to rejection. Everybody hates me. Like, that's not a very warrior. Like, she's, she's a very extremely competent person, just like most women out there who get passed over for some shit. And I don't know, her, her personality just kind of, it's not very exciting. What does someone have to do to get you to flirt with them? Not much at all, but I get a little extra jolt when I'm matched wink for wink. So just be yourself and the flirts will flow. What? Thanks what for chatting. We'll talk again that? later. Ugh. You know it. I truly hate... Okay, I'm not gonna say that. I don't hate whoever wrote the dialogue. I understand they are a human being with feelings. But I'm angry at you, random people who wrote the dialogue. I'm upset. I'm disappointed in you. Strike team ready for deployment. Let's go to a plan. 
know what? Just because sometimes this game is crazy, I'm gonna save before I go to a planet. So which one, guys? Bold or Havarl? I wonder if that blinking means that there's an anomaly detected. Havarl is awesome. Okay, so we got one go for the Varl. Varl. I guess I should have listened to that. I can feel the Scourge's drag on the ship. At least it keeps Aya hidden. Some galaxies are blinking and some aren't. Bedlam? Why is that shit glowing? None of this makes any sense. Explain yourself. I don't like snow cones. Not at all. Have I been to Nilesh? Alright, nobody else cares where I go. Only Jody cares where I go. Ooh, look how pretty it is. from the asteroid oh, belt. Detected. Jarl, why are you on my comm link? Oh, that was me not paying attention. Shit. Oops. Too busy petting this adorable fucking cat. up something. Probes launched. I found something. Well, good for you. Wait, what? Very good. 
confused. I thought I was going to Havaro. But that planet said it was called something else. <laughs> Did y'all see me launch a probe somewhere that I wasn't paying attention to? Was it Pop Bar? Okay, maybe it was Pop Bar. Yeah, I worked, I worked kinda hard on my character, Neo Neo. I'm pretty pleased with the way she turned out. I like her face a lot. And I love her tattoo. I wish I could also give her the neck tattoo, though. This planet looks like a dinosaur landed on it. Did I? What the fuck happened? I launched a probe, right? Where did the fucking probe go? If anyone noticed, please, please advise. <laughs> Anomaly on sensors. There is an anomaly. Maybe this one's it? I don't know. Deploying probe. Probe. Tracking a huge mineral deposit. Yeah, give it to me. Give me that graphite. Isn't that what we make pencils out of? Sulfur, iron, and plutonium compels the bulk of the sapphires. Powerful storms shift in magnitude as it orbits around gas giant Yenu. Yenu. Hi. Was it the comet? Is this the place I was supposed to go? I don't know, man. I don't know. Samurai Jack. Some people think that the new series isn't as good as the old one, and some people think it is. What do you guys, have? It, any of you guys were watching Samurai Jack? Yep, it was that comment. All right, I feel slightly dumb. Trainer Jody, what? You really should watch, at least watch the old one. See if you'll like it. Samurai Jack is one of my favorite cartoons. And I don't like a lot of cartoons except for anime, to be perfectly honest. American cartoons after, I guess, like, what year would that have been? Maybe the 80s or so? I didn't really enjoy them. Anomaly on Sansers. Which makes me a traitor. It's mostly due to the art style. Even Samurai Jack sometimes gets on my nerve with their with their art style. They'll have like beautiful colors and scenes, and then it'll be like this ugly ass. The flying probe. I'm like, why? I find Jesus. something. Massive fungal forests, biomatter growth. All right. I guess I. If I wanted a fungal forest, it's not actually very long, so it doesn't take much time. The episodes I think are only maybe twenty minutes. Anyway, the new Samurai Jack is incredibly dark, much darker than the old Samurai Jack. And I guess the people arguing against it are like, it's not charming anymore as a show. And the people arguing for it are like, oh, but this thing and that thing. And I think I need to watch more episodes before I join into the conversation of the new one. Because I'm also kind of feeling like, damn, this show is just fucking sad right now. Like, this is some Game of Thrones kind of shit right here. Uh, but the art keeps me watching anyway, so I hope it I hope it lifts soon because right now it's just been down, just a real downer. All right, let's go to another planet. I'm so excited! Mm. Yeah, 
yeah, I'll keep both of those weapons, even though it means I don't get to have a third weapon, which is bush lucky. Damage resistance, weapon accuracy, power restoration. I'm gonna go with this one. Can I give it a mod? No, I don't want that mod. Fuck that mod. No, those seem to be my arms. Cool. Got my two PCs. Uh, let's trade you for the jaw. It makes the most sense to me. And let's see. What the fuck is that? Hang on, guys. Doggy, why are you in my side of the yard? You better not shit in my side of the yard, doggy. <laughs> it was just my neighbor's dog. I gotta get used to the fact that there's a giant animal now living downstairs. Ah, uh, should I take Vetra? I like her power shields a lot. They're pretty useful. Hmm. Hello, human tornado. Hmm, but Peeny might be really interested in the science of what's going on. Cat, what are you doing? Cora bores me, so I'm not gonna take her. Drac is a warrior. Probably not best to- Well, we'll get into some fights. I'm sure I'll be able to call him in if we get into some big old fights. Liam's kind of boring, so we've got an academic or the mercenary. I think I'll keep Vetra. I like Vetra. I can assign a paint job? Give me. Uh, I like paint. Ice cream, ice cream, ice cream paint job. Cream Sending the nav point for Darpalev. Wait. That's where the Moshai's team should be. Outside, whichever version. Look at how beautiful the ship is. It used to be an Angaran town. There'll be landing pads and good sight lines for a safe approach. Anomaly on the sensors. Something big, possibly hostile, taking evasive action. Wait, I don't think his... See you back home. Of course you do this during a cutscene. Of course. Bringing us in. I do have a choppable chest as I learned in Portugal. Oh, I should scan things. Yes, I scan things. I think I shall head towards danger. I thought I was beautiful. 
This blows it away. It is beautiful. But the wilds can also be deadly. So I thought, um, she said I thought I was beautiful, which I'm like, damn girl, really? <laughs> All right, make contact with the scientist. Yeah, so this is where I, I want to go because I want to hang out by this dropship thing. So which way is it? It is this way. I do have to fuck with those bugs very well. Do, 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 do. Got it. And do. Oh, this is, oh. Maybe there's actually a path I can follow? This planet's very dark, okay? It's hard to see. Stranger on your frickin' island, and you're like, nah, you're good. These readings show any. Jarl, what are you doing here in the company of these people? Kiran, this is Pathfinder Ryder from a long way away. Ryder, Kiran Dals, lead scientist at Dar Palev. I'm honored to meet you. Uh, professional or wild? I am honored to meet you, as a representative of the Andromeda Initiative. Are all their people this formal? I don't think so. Where's the rest of the team? Ryder has experience with Remnant. We might uh, be able to help the their investigations. The you haven't heard? While the team was exploring the monolith, something went terribly wrong. They were caught in some kind of Remnant stasis field, frozen in place, unresponsive. I know how to work Remnant Tech. I can help you. Ryder has seen a vault and apparently reset it. Mm -hmm. Somehow. Mm -hmm. I'm real good Ocean of fish, one will have gems in its mouth. But if you think the alien can help, I'll set skepticism aside. The beer. monolith is not far from here. See what you can do, but be careful. We don't know what triggered the stasis and it may happen again. Don't get your tentacles in a twist, lady. Let's read this data pad. An incredible find out in the field, a shuttle from before the scourge surfaced down in the ravine. From afar, it looks like the crash site was remarkably preserved, especially to have withstood Havari's elements. I know Kieran tasked me with studying the monolith, but maybe I can make my way down there and just, just take a little peek. Just a little look. Let's see. Hello, Paco Valley. I heard the advisory that you'd be out here. You didn't prepare me to meet you. Are you the name's Ryder. I'm with the Andromeda Initiative. They say you want to help us. I wonder what you're prepared to do. Oh, what do you want? If it gets me on your good side, I'm in. That's reassuring, assuming you mean well. My name is Rochelle Veer. I'm an archaeastronomer. Archaeastronomer? I study our ancient cultural records for stellar phenomena. I piece together lost knowledge of ages that past. Really fun. My goal is to find undiscovered colonies we lost contact with, potential allies against the Ket. You think there might be Angara worlds you don't know about? That's what I was trying to learn. Then this happened. I was away when the disaster struck. I, don't really get the timeline. I thought my home either. was destroyed, and all my research with it, but I just learned part of the building survived. Hello, Erlevness. I'm trying to recover my research data, but the wildlife won't let me near my I'll kill home. all the motherfucking bugs for you, girl. You know what? 
I can kill a bug. Yep. Mm -hmm. I'll do Your it. work is too important to lose. Let's get it back. I'll provide my home's location. Just my recover my location. research materials from the computer. I'm joking. I'll remain in contact with you by com. I'm gonna just repeat Thank you for this. She says because she sounds All right. Thank you, Miss Alien, for not being as much of an asshole as your alien friend. Solar heater. Why are there heaters all over this game, and why do they think it's important? You tell me. Uh, I'm enjoying it okay. I'm pretty addicted to it. There are things that bother me, the dialogue, the facial expressions, but um, yeah, some things just not making sense. But other than that, uh, I'm playing it. Good to care that here the cat haven't reached your research post. We're not so lucky here. They're practically swarming the old temples trying to dismantle the remnant tech. We're trying to fight them off, but even with resistance reinforcements, there are just too many of them. Commander called the retreat. I know you've had your eye on those temples, but there's nothing we can do. We're closing the area down. Crash site. Thank you so much for bringing this to crash site. It's well preserved. I'd give anything to see it. I'll see if I can stand, send someone capable to check it out. Please make sure Torvar doesn't hear about it. I know he'll want to take a look. I think that's the data pad we found before. I was addicted to it, but I only had a rental copy and I had to go back today. Oh, it sucks. I'm sure you've heard about the attack on Site 7. The locks of Dr. Vereshav was a blow to the entire science community, and now many of Site 7's researchers are displaced and in need of a new post. Most will head to Aya for recovery, but some want to continue working here on Haval. I recommend your camp as a suitable transition point. Uh, the Ket have ignored your site. I'm sure you could use them. Blah, blah, blah. Dear Kieran, you're safe, right? I heard about the attack on the old city. I know you're on the other side of the planet, but it's still too close. The no, that's the other side of the planet. Okay, anyway. Uh, place is dangerous. We worry about you. Work is important. I promise your old mother that if the resistance tells you... Oh, pro oh, this is her mother. None of this knowledge is worth the risk of I mended too many of your broken bones when you were young. It's time to give me a break. This is your mother who misses you. Aww. Yes, you do have to ignore people being like... Like, um, I played with... Make, uh, Malika over on Hyper RPGs, I played her character and she just had the standard Sarah Ryder and every cutscene I was distracted by how hideous <laughs> she was just like the whole time. I attached the data gathered from our efforts to help map the Sporge. Alright, start guide you for Rico. Wait, why did that thing do that? Why you do? <laughs> no transports available. Emergency support for cat attacks. Or Established in the Shadow Remnant Village, Palab was the center of trade and learning. Anyone who wished to observe working Remnant Malas was directed there. Deep within the tunnel, we could hear the hum of mysterious machines. True dramatic, this is a history book, not a thriller. Note to self, mention that the entire Dara was overtaken by the jungle. Also mention the Remnant errors we're still told to avoid. Old Man Luge. What's he doing here? Old Man Luge. What's up? What? You... Alright, fine. Sorry, I'm clearly in the wrong place. <sighs> You're that alien visitor so that came to Aya asking about our vault. To them, You've heard of me. Who hasn't? When strange new species turn up, reports spread fast. After the cat, can't be too careful. Luge Anson, historian with the repository of history. Aya, listen, if there's nothing you need, could you go away? I'm busy trying to get transport off this cursed planet. Sure, I'll go away. No problem. Bye. I won't bother you further. Very well. Watch out for plants while you're out there. Vicious, Vicious things. Uh, I'm trying to romance Jarl. He's not taking it. I'm trying to romance um, Zetra. She's taking it pretty well. For funsies, I'm flirting with PV, but I don't actually like her, and I hope she says no. But, you know, if it's bangable, I want to bang it. This is my life. It's who I am. I'm Sarah the Rebel, and I bang people, you know? The real question is, who are you? See, I don't really like Susie. She uh, she talks really slow. It really bothers me the way she talks. I'm obviously very shallow, by the way. 
pee me annoys me, core is too boring, Subi talks dumb. Yeah. Very hard to please. Sorry. Sorry to all of you who wanted to thank me. The name I, I was mentioning this on Twitter. There aren't really warriors in this one, except for Drac, which makes sense because, you know, we're if we're sending a delegation off to another galaxy, we don't send our crazy unhinged biotics, we don't send our assassins, we don't send dishonorable people who have been kicked out of places, we send the good people. So it makes sense that Liam and Cora are so boring in my book, and that Petra is um, like not even a warrior, she's like a mercenary, and Jal is just a curious cat. It all makes sense, but it doesn't make for good bank money. I just heard a dinosaur, did y'all hear a dinosaur? Yeah, I don't like her accent or the way that she just looks like she's supposed to be a sex. She's just like got her deep eyeliner and her red hair and she's like, the universe is so beautiful. I'm just like, I can't. Yeah. <laughs> Automated protocols activated. Deploying forward station. No titties for you, bitch! I've detected multiple life forms in the area. Their movements appear agitated. I think we stirred up a nest. One of them just spit it. I forgot it. 
animal cruelty if they attack first? Give it everything I got. They don't want none. They don't want none. Good, good, good. Everything is awesome. Everything is awesome when you murder the wildlife. Everything is awesome. Guard Integrated Tech Node. P Research Coordination. Good morning. Hello, Fabio CD. They left at me. They literally attacked first because I was unable to. Uh, Pathfinder, the computer. Pathfinder, the computer's data core is damaged beyond repair. Damn it. Rochelle, it's Ryder. We're inside your old home, but your research data didn't survive. All your effort and risk for nothing. I'm sorry. I can't imagine what you're feeling right now. Shouldn't have let myself hope. You didn't have backups? Of course, but they went down with the city's network memory center. That site is now buried Very underground. Hungry. Even if you could find an access point on the surface, the odds of recovering anything are remote. Damn. Well, that's All I heard is, there's a chance. Let's go for it. That didn't fully translate, but I know optimism when I hear it. I can point you in the general direction of where the network memory center used to be. You'll have to hunt for an exposed network node. I'll stand by. Thank you, Pathfinder. Of course. Again, I have nothing better to do. I will run all the errands of everyone on this planet. Uh, but no, you guys are absolutely wrong. You can watch the stream back and see that the animal literally bit into my arm before I did anything to it. There's some sort of setting on here where I can't shoot unless I'm actually engaged in combat. Or, uh, or melee unless I'm actively already engaged in combat. So you can take your misguided attempts to love a vicious animal that tried to kill me and shove them right up your butt cheek. Right up in there. Get it in. Or we could fast travel and be there damn near immediately. Let's do that. I'll be there right now. For anyone who missed that, I just finished doing Pilates, which is also why my picture was fuzzy. You know, maybe you've never been hugged, but you usually don't hug somebody teeth first. You know, you don't, uh, let me hug you, you know, you, 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 you arms first, arms. You all are just gonna make it easier when I abandon you in this, uh, world to fester and Pathfinder, I've detected energy readings consistent with an active network node. Is it on the surface? We'll find out. Well, how convenient for us. I wonder if I'd get anything on the scanner. Secret network! Network connection is established. Wait, so I'm locking in. Searching. I found them. Research files downloading. And done. You did it. Yes, I did. <laughs> we did it. Go team. If we recovered this data, we may be able to access everything lost in the disaster. I'll alert my colleagues. You've accomplished something amazing, Pathfinder. It was literally 10 to 20 feet from where you're standing, and you didn't look around? This is beyond unbelievable. Come on. You are the worst scientist I've ever met in my life list. So I wonder how this whole city just, like, went underground. How many aliens have you guys met before me? Charming. I know you told me not to go near the ancient crash site, but uh, I did what I wanted. You were right. Too difficult to get there. Remnant chased us off before we got halfway down. Hopefully you can get here yourself. You're always good at dodging those machines. 
Though I don't know if it'll be safe with those outsiders roaming around. The spiky ones, have you seen them? I got off track. The point is, you were right. We're studying the monolith. Spiky ones? I don't think I'm spiky. Who are the spiky ones? <coughs> yeah, I think I'm not very spiky. I'm getting all these chemicals, girl. Get the vitamins. Getting the vitamins. What the fuck is that? Some advice. Your stream is not in the Mass Effect Andromeda category. Always remove the TM from the game name. The TM. Karen Dawson. I'll go look at that, because I don't know what you're talking about. <clears throat> what are you What are you What are you What are you at? Then it go. Because that was the thing I tried to check right at the beginning. Nope, that's not Twitch. This is Twitter. All right, it's updated. Thank you for the advice. I see what you need now. Hey, Bailey, what you being so jumpy for? Because you know you're a badass who knocked all Mama's candles down? You bitch ass hoe. Oh, baby Jesus. In an ocean of fish, one will have gems in its mouth. Meaning your success with Remnant is probability, not skill. As the number of cases approaches infinity, the unlikeliest outcomes become likely. Oh, thought it might have been something like that. Well, go fuck yourself, everybody who doubts me. I have a very high uh, self esteem. So, it doesn't hurt my feelings at all. We're not alone. We're not alone. I think we are. I think we're wrong. I think everything they said to us is below us and therefore not a threat. mission collect a plant sample sure it's not like i'm busy or uh, a scientist with things to do nope 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 i have plenty of time in the name of science i rebuke you i had a nickel every time i found nickel i detect an andromeda plant sample nearby Dr. Camden would find this useful. Oh? Oh, right. The gardener. Botanist, Pathfinder. Wow, Pathfinder. Wow. That's a little rude. You you think he's not a scientist like you are? Enemies! Pulling up. 
pulling out the fancy moves. Yep, that is a bad one. Resolved it. Gene. Now I could go to this ravine, or I could go where I'm supposed to go. I'm going to the ravine. an 
every solar heater. Huh? Give me the next piece. Very well. Hello, container. I love how much loot there is on this planet. I'm giddy with loot. I'm giddy, I say. We've scanned this area. These structures go deep below the ground. Stay alert. We don't know what's down there. If those floaty remnant bots try to push us off the edge, I'll be mad. I'll be mad. Okay, Mom. something. Guess we'll try again later. Hi, Vipers. What is, uh... We're not serious freaking problem guys i'm going to planned parenthood tomorrow because i'm sitting here like i'm fuck an ugly person that i don't even like at this moment because that's how bad things are no one activating automated forward Lucy station deployment yeah so it's a bunch of people who maybe don't remember who i am eating sundry um but i'm happy they're here hello all of you people I'm sure my stream will cut out momentarily because my stream always cuts out when I get to 100 because maybe PlayStation's a bit of an asshole, who knows? Yeah! That call. I love my nickel work. I love my nickel work. I love my nickel work. Cause you can be it. What? Oh, that's a reference to I came from the host and it might be that I'm on mobile and have a low voice bandwidth, but you appear to be in a peculiar state of nudity. <laughs> yes! I am butt ass naked. Just kidding, I'm not naked. You it's such a polite way to say that too. Like, excuse me, ma'am. Are you butt ass naked? Are you butterball naked at this exact moment, ma'am? I'm gonna die. Oops, I fucked up. I fucked up. I made a mistake. <laughs> now or I could do what I'm supposed to do I'm gonna go down into the ravine that's who I am you know technically we're all nude under our clothes what if I was naked what would you do just leave I'd be upset <laughs> I'm very curious oh I thought that was a ladder but it's not a ladder ow <laughs> there at heights don't get along it's just constantly throwing myself into the ravine Okay, we're fine. Everything's fine. We're going to. Ooh, look at another one. God damn it. I once, for Geek and Sundry, in fact, I went to a red carpet. I was recording for Geek and Sundry. And I got, um, oh, what's his name? John Lugano to sing Everybody Do the Dinosaur, but I had him sing Geek and Sundry Do the Dinosaur, and that's one of my proudest moments of my life. I was like, no, 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 no. What's that for? And then he said, Kiki's not to do that dinosaur. And he did a little dance thing. 
guy next to me, the reporter next to me, mistook him for some other Mexican person. Some Mexican person. I don't know. It was a bit of a, a bit of a. Let's do this. But it made me feel better because I was like, "Wow, I can't find so many worse." Enemy down with Ramos' face and is looking for someone else. I'm doing excellent, man. I am just having the time of my life. There's a new Patreon short story up on my Patreon. That's it. If you guys don't know, um, I write short stories. That's the point. I don't know. I write them. They will be. being impolite. So fun fact for the all of you people in here, I do not ban people very much. Site Avela mentioned. I'll pause it because it's important for you to know since there's a bunch of new people. My belief is that if you want to talk some shit, go ahead and talk some shit and I'm gonna destroy you emotionally and then you'll stop talking shit and then we'll all be friends like in a anime. So don't be afraid of being banned and back out my dad.
emits a gentle blue-green light as a result of enzymatic, enzymatic reactions. It is swarming with insects which appear to have taken on the same bioluminescent quality, likely as a result of the Thank you. 